where after the football group around how long had he stood uh, frozen like some sort of idiot one or two of them was smirking Matt struggled to finish his sentence but he had nothing more to say Lou's having muttered and walked away the other boys went with him leaving Matt standing on his own outside the chapel door it was half past nine first lessons begin 30 miles away the police had closed an entry street seal sealing its end with blue and white tape and the usual signs please do not cross the unconscious man had been discovered by an old man he had been lying on the pavement about 100 metres away from a shell, shell, 100 metres away from the shell bridge. The paramedics arrived and they, had, and, they, and they had quickly established that he had been hit once with a blunt instrument possible a hammer or a crowbar. His skull was fractured, but the good, good news was that he was going to live. He'd, he'd sustained stained other injuries to and the police suspect that he might have been a passenger in some of sort of truck perhaps he had been pushed out while the vehicle was moving at speed it had been easily it identified him there was a wallet in his back pocket complete with cash and credit cards the fact that he it the fact it hadn't been taken automatically ruled out thief Effect as a motive, his wife in Flock store had already been contracted and, and taken at high speed to the emergency ward of the hospital where he where he was being treated from her. The police had learned that Harry Shepherd hadn't been a passenger, he had been a driver. He worked for the Shell Petroleum Company and should have been delivering 2,000 litres of fuel to the garage close to the spot where he had been found injured. Oh, more unbelievable the place we were wasted up all hours before there before they realized is that seriously the, the petrol tanker itself perhaps it had, had been less obvious less huge they might have noticed sooner but at least they put two ever and act with uh, Urgency, they had already cut Charles Force, Charles Office at Flocks and the registration number of the vehicle. There was no need for a description, was being cir circulated, calculated to all units. The petrol in the tank was worth many thousands of pounds. Was this why the driver had been knocked out? Is hoped, hoped so because, because simply theft was something they could handle. It was centrally a lot less worrying than the altitude. Alt, alt, 
it here, but the was still there. This night after, I'll be a quite quit diff different sort of crime. Suppose the tank had been taken by terrorists. The local police police put a call through to London, and a news blackout was on. There was no real. Re, re, no reason yet to start a panic as as they searched the roads up and down Yorkshire. The police reminded remembered tight lipped, but there are no ten thousand my ten thousand litres of peril could send a very large bonfire. Indeed, they didn't want to admit they were afraid. The morning only got worse. Matt arrived five minutes late before his first lesson, stumbling into the classroom with with while the teacher's thought was in full flow. I'm sorry if I'm late, miss. Why are you late, Matthew? How could he explain? How could he tell her that he had some sort of praetorian outside the school chapel that had left him paralysed and uncertain what to do? I forgot my bag, he said. It was a lie, but it was simpler than the truth. Well, I'm a I'm going to have to put you in the detention book, Miss Ford. Signed now. Will you please take your seat? Matt's desk was right at the back of the classroom, and although he kept his eyes fixed on the floor, he felt everyone watching him as he looked as he looked as he took his place. Miss Ford was one of the better teachers at Forest Hill. She was plain and all fastened, which somehow suited her as, the, as she taught history. But she had been kind to that and had tried to help him fill in the gaps in his in English for his past, but had had done his best to catch up reading extra books after school day or studying the Second World War <laughs> and he found it more interesting than the medieval kings or endless list, lists of dates it might be history but it mattered now even so he was unable to con Curate today, Miss Ford was telling him about Dunkirk Bay. Dunkirk Bay in Dunkirk Bay, and I did thought him about trying to follow. <laughs> what she was saying, but he couldn't make the words link. She Seemed a long way, long way away, and was it is today's or had become very warm in the classroom. The habit was cut off, and it seemed to many people in England that the war was already lost. Matt looked out of the window. Once again, he became aware of the tree, of a sharp acid smell of burning toast, and that was when he saw it floating through the air, making no sound. It was some sort of lorry. There was a fi there was a figure unst behind the wheel, but the sunlight was reflected off the windshield of reflections reflecting off 
the windscreen and he couldn't make it out like a great, great beast it soared towards the skull plummeting out of the sky its head lamps were its eyes the radiator girly was a gap gapping mouth gaping mouth the tag seemed to stretch into the distance a huge gleaming silver cylinder on, tw on twelve thick tyres clo closer and closer it came now it filled up with, filled up the old window and was about to pass through but what is that Everyone was staring at him again. Miss Ford had stopped whatever she was saying and was looking at him with a mix with a bit of impatience and concern. Nothing nothing Miss Ford will stop staring well will stop staring out will stop staring out of the window and try to con con concentrate as I was saying. Many people thought that Dunkirk was a miracle, but wanted a few moments, then glanced out of the window again. The classroom looked across to the sports centre. Sports centre and a solid brick building on the other side, side, other side of the field separate of the main part of the school by a single road which rose steeply and then continued by towards York. There was a traffic. It was a beautiful day but pressed a hand against his forehead when he threw it away there was sweet on his palm. What was wrong with him? What was wrong what was going on. Somehow he managed to stumble through history and then physical and PE but PE but last lesson of the morning just had to be English with Mr King. They were reading Macbeth and found Shakespeare difficult even Shakespeare difficult enough at the best of times today it meant nothing to him. And Mr. King seemed to have built a radar that allowed him to allowed him to home in allowed him to home in on anyone who was wasn't paying attention. It took it only took him a few minutes before he pronounced a bat about am i bouncing you freeman he asked with an unpleasant snare no then perhaps you could tell him what i was just saying about the three weird sisters but chucked his head he might as well admit it i'm sorry sir i was i wasn't listening and come and see me at the end of the lesson mr king Rust a stand of air out of his eyes. The weird sisters tell Macbeth his future. He went on, and of course, he believes them in Shakespeare. Shakespeare's times, many people still believed in witchcraft, witchcraft, and black magic. Subscribe, subscribe, hit the bell, share, like, thank you. Subscribe, hit the bell, share, like, thank you. Click on my screen with thumbnail. Let's move this from start to finish.